I am finally feeling a little bit better today after having surgery last Wednesday. I'm feeling a little bit like myself. And one of our team members had just put up a reel a couple of hours ago that is getting a lot of attention. And when I realized just now watching the reel for the first time, and it's like already got like 12,000 views, which is just crazy. But the reel was from when we took pictures on February 1st when we went grocery shopping. This is the parsley in the reel that is going viral right now. It is over a month old. So what is that? Like 40 days old? It's like almost, I don't know what day it is. It's almost the 10th. I make a mic stand on his toes. That was funny. So he was like, make it lower. Anyways, this is the parsley from the reel that is going viral right now. This was purchased on February 1st. This is the cilantro that I bought on March 1st. I didn't buy any parsley this time. You can see how clear this water is and how pretty it is. And then these are the asparagus. Look at the tops. They're still looking pretty good. This one's a little rough. But um, these asparagus were purchased at Costco on February 1st also. So I'm going to show you what I do with these things real quick since it's like time to do this. But every couple of weeks I dump out this water and I'll put more filtered water in there. Just going to go ahead and do that since I can one it. So, and the first time I get these, I snap the ends, and the second time, or any time after I'm cutting it, I do it just like flowers, and I just recut the ends to help them um, get water again. So that's new water in the glass. The asparagus is going in there. We'll probably have those in the next day or two. This. I should put in the chicken bowl. Okay, so this is the parsley from February 1st, so like 40 days old. This one is getting a little yellow. I'll probably pull that one out. This one's a little crinkly. I have some asparagus left on my hand. The ones that have been in the water, I'm just going to put those in the chicken bowl. And dump this water out. I'm going to add new filtered water. It's so important it's filtered whatever you normally drink as water. And then again, the same with this. I'm going to trim the ends. I like when they all match up. You don't have to be so particular about it but I'm going to trim the ends and make new fresh or cool I can't say it I can I know what it is it's like new veins this one's floppy but it's going to be floppy but still this is parsley from February 1st like 40 days old this was the cilantro that I just bought well just bought but still like 10 days old so are there any questions while we're on here one question everybody always wants to know about avocados avocados do you recommend freezing avocados oh no I don't normally freeze them but Today on the Today Show, doo -doo -doo, I'm going to reach out to them because they debunked that putting um, avocados in water blog post that was going crazy a couple days ago saying it's not safe to do it, which I totally was saying the same thing. Don't do that. So if you go to thecrosslegacy.com and go to our avocados um, post, I talk about how we have, oh, you can show them my microgreens, how we have um, avocados that we keep in the refrigerator for a month, and if you keep them next to your lemons, it helps. I was pretty excited that they debunked the um, avocados in water. Like, that was not my suggestion, because that suggestion was telling people that their avocados would last for two weeks. I can get your avocados to last for a month. So, these are from February 1st. It is March. I don't know. I should have checked what, what's the date? Is it the 9th or the 10th? The 9th. The 9th. They're like 40 days old, almost, whatever. It's March. <laughs> and then these are the March ones. So anyways, have a good night and um, we will see you later.